Hey, it's Fate. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna go do a Koshai thing, thingy, uh, video. Yeah. Uh, I'll show you a cool trick. If you go Pursuit, Koshai, and do Public, there's nobody there. It's just dead. Totally dead. Nobody wants to do this. It's not because Monster Hunter got released. No, actually, though, it's not. Like, literally nobody is queuing for her at Like It takes forever to get a group. Um, so, gear. If you don't run Evasive Fury, Aether Hunter, Rage Hunter, and a sword in your first Koshai fights, then um, just don't watch the rest of this video because... Okay, yeah, I'm kidding, but... Seriously, though, it... I... This fight is so much faster paced than any other fight that's been in the game so far that there's it's, you need the attack speed and the sword is really easy to learn with. So yeah. Anyway, I saw Ben do this. It was cool. You can jump into the thorns and just attack stuff and make your own little area and then you can dodge through other thorns to get out. It's helpful because you can just stand still after landing and breaking the thorns under you and revive teammates or use the eighth event. That's the only way that you should really be breaking thorns. There's no reason to do it otherwise. Um, except for after he runs away, I guess. Um, I'll get a little bit more in-depth into gear, I suppose, but... Now, first of all, I am using a Kosha helmet, and nobody's allowed to complain about this, because you could just do the same thing with a Reza helmet. It doesn't really matter. Just had a technique slot. It's got good stats. I put it on. Um, and I, I'm not kidding you when I say... Um, I'm very, very short on notes, so I would rather not extract the cell. <laughs> uh, actually, if anybody's short on notes and they're having trouble figuring out a way to get more and they're really lazy and they don't want to hunt for it, then I had like over a hundred of these and I just started salvaging them. That's been funding all of my extractions recently. Uh, so yeah, but... Uh, plus 10 gear, if you don't have plus 10 gear by now, then... Like, by the time you're in Koshai, I mean, heroic Koshai, whatever, dude. I mean, good job. You got here. Uh, now, go back and go get your plus 10. Uh, and if you don't do that and you watch this video and then you just just solo Koshai immediately uh, or kill him in a group immediately and you just carry everybody, then please post that in a comment because uh, I'm going to use it in my partner application. Uh, and take all the credit. So, here we go. He's going to... Do dead eye things, and then he's gonna do thorn bram. I'm calling these brambles from now on. Bramble things, which, by the way, if you kill that blue flower, it kills all of them. Uh, otherwise, they just respawn. He has a double tail swipe, drask things, and he has a claw attack, drask things. This is Koshai things. He stares at you and then attacks you. Double tail swipe. Drask swipe thingy, another one. Tail swipe, probably? No, okay. That's the leap. You want to go with that, if at all possible, so that you land, like, close enough to start hitting him again. That was cool. Again, try to dodge with that. If I don't do that for the entire video, it's because I'm lazy. Also, I just was not going to get out of that, so I didn't try to. And I'm calling these Drask tail swipes and stuff to trigger people that are saying he's a Drask clone. He isn't. It, it's just funny. Um, roll with or don't. It's fine. He's going to go into rage or whatever soon. Um, when he goes into the vine thing, he's like in the ground like that. He can't possibly hurt you when he's going in. Okay. Oop. Nope. Notice, like, even with Evasive Fury, I'm barely getting three attacks off. Okay. I'm actually using Energize on a sword. I know, right? Um, Fate said never to do that. No. For real, though. Uh... You just don't have enough time to queue after a combo in this fight. There's nothing. 
There's nothing you can do to do that unless he's on the ground. Uh, by the way, I just got really greedy and got hugely punished for it. Whenever Koshai enrages, you know, there's that big red bubble like there is in any hunt. And uh, that it can't hurt you in this one for some reason. It just can't. Oh, I am so boned. No. Okay. No, those are all the potions I'm going to use. Whoop. Roll with it. Come here. He's Okay, sometimes you have to punch him on the nose. Just give him a little love tap before he will start hitting you again. I mean, obviously, we don't want to be exploiting the game and just let him stare at us. Oh, okay. This is not good. Um, if you don't have evasive fury at all, meaning, like, you don't have blood fire gloves, sir... Um, then you can just use your sword cue to get some attack speed. So this is Aether mode. He uh, rips out his arms and uh, replaces them with vines. And then uses my nine lives and then does his blue shell thing. I'm in a really shit spot right now. Um, so, whoop. This blue shell, which I seriously hope was not a visual pun on the part of the developers, but if it was, then I guess props to them for that. Uh, okay, so he's in the vine. You can boop that by doing enough damage. If you don't, then these things fall down and do damage to you. Fun, fun. Um, this blue shell blocks projectiles like so. I don't know if that hurts him or not, but it also makes you unable to regen stamina while you're inside of it. Fun. And uh, makes you slow. So you need to be super aware of like how you're you're doing in that department, like the stamina department. Uh, that was a charge animation that he does. Cool. Whatever. And I don't... Oh yeah, he's losing his enrage right there. Whoop. Again, be really patient, cause, you know, because your iframes are going to fail you at some point in this hunt, so you just have to, like, accept that. <clears throat> I was actually going to say because he attacks very often, and um, you just can't get greedy or it's going to punish you. And rah! Kill the flower! Say no to drugs. Um, by the way, I figured out what kind of animal Koshai is. What, what like, amalgamation he is. Uh, right, so, like, apart from the, the planty stuff, whatever you want to call that, he's, like, um, pangolin, elk, hawk, wolf. I think, I don't think I'm forgetting one, but yeah. Although I'm not sure where the tail comes from. I'm going to say lizard. Because it kind of feels thorny devil-esque and he has spikes and stuff too. But yeah, those are the animals. And the hawk is because it's not like an owl face. And, like, the beak is too not owly. Because owl beaks are like little peckers. And I don't mean that the way it sounds. And then, like, hawk beaks are more like, you know, the, the curve thing. He didn't go into eighth. Oh, did he did go into aether mode, right? Did he? Yeah. So, his aether mode. Uh, I forgot to explain that. It's the antler stuff. And when he does the antler stuff, you can break the antlers to get antlers. So, yeah, that's a thing. Um, otherwise, he just jumps around a lot. Uh, does his little pounce thing from underground. Like, he can go underground and then come up in his pounce and be like, Sup, bitch! And then you're like, Sup, bitch! And then you fight. Like in an animu. Also, where 
the hell? He's got to be up there, and I just didn't look. Watch him be, like, full health by the time I get there. That would be a cool mechanic. They used to have that, actually, in Resikiri. Like, when Resikiri first got released, as soon as it ran away, it would just start spam healing itself at the fountain. So, everybody had to, like, split up and, like, coordinate their efforts to find the Resikiri before it healed itself all the way again. And, like, back then, it could also just murder you in one or two hits, like, no matter what gear you had also. So, it was pretty cool. There we go. Also, I forgot who mentioned this. I think it was maintained said that isn't this supposed to be like some sort of nature behemoth and it's murdering all the trees he should get stronger for killing or weaker for killing trees like every tree that dies should weaken him even if it's just like 0.001 percent it'd be a good easter egg oh <clears throat> that was mm. okay so yeah these are the antlers again you break these, and you break the antlers, you get antlers. And then he does this Mr. Fantastic bullcrap. Um, which, by the way, you just have to see it coming and dodge it. Like, there's not really much of a tell. But he generally only does it if you're not right in front of him. Um, he's going to put thorns here because he's a dick. Wow, he's just covered this area already. And I'm probably... Honestly, in this situation, I'm just going to make the motherfucker come to me. Like, he's going to come just out of the ground... Like a puppy after kibble. And now I'm using that because my puppy does this for kibble. But. Um, yeah, he'll just kind of come out. And he'll do a couple. Just koshai things. Generally. And then go back in. Although right now he's not wanting to do the koshai things. And then go back down. He's. Oh. I've never had him do this twice to me in one solo fight. This is cool, dude. You're cool. You're cool. Yeah, you're cool. I'm just going to have to dodge this. Because, again, I, I've only landed that boop like one time in a solo. It's absurdly AIDS. That was him shooting quills. If you get hit by it, it does damage. And the tell is him swiping his tail. That was... Sometimes he just, you know, stares you down and tries to do koshai things. For no better reason than staring you down. Like, literally, he just does it. You have to hit him or else he's just going to keep staring at you for, like, ten seconds. Like... Like that. <laughs> Except for that was much shorter than it usually is. Oops, that apparently didn't do much. Fight me, bitch. Oh. I should have dropped my uh, lantern there. Okay, so he's losing his enrage. And he's dizzy, but I can't really get too greedy because he's going to charge. Yeah. Cool. And again... Oh my... Holy sh... I've never seen that happen before. I've never seen anybody get an antler break solo with a sword. Or even... Holy hell. Holy hell. Holy hell. That's... Oh my god. No way. Watch me die on the fucking thorns now. <laughs> That's crazy, dude. Oh, uh, by the way, lanterns can break thorns, too. Uh, so can grenades. Oh my god. I have never seen that. I'm, if I hadn't recorded it, that... I've heard of somebody getting it with an axe, but... I don't know, even think it was solo. I think it was just... Wow. Wow. Yeah, you better give me all three of those things. Good God. I don't even need them anymore, but... Oh, man. That's crazy. Sorry, I'm like... Completely... I have no idea how that happened. I really don't. There's n That does not happen. That's just not a thing. So, yeah. Don't go doing this and expecting to get an antler break. I, I literally had to, I made a whole video on how to get antler breaks, okay? Like, it's not... I'm not using anything to get those right now. It just happened. Like... <laughs> I'm still... Uh, at least I've explained everything he does. Oops. So, you know... I mean, explained, in quotations. Because 
I'm just not going to forget about that for the rest of the fight. Watch me. I'm going to lose, though. What? What? How did you? What? How is... <laughs> how did I even get a break there? I didn't even hit him. What the hell? All right, whatever. I'm not, I'm not even tripping. But yeah, that's actually a really long solo for me in here. But whatever, I'll take it. It's a lot harder to do this when you're talking and whatnot. But yeah, I hope this was helpful, guys. Like, I don't really know another way to... You know, do a tutorial like this. I... I, for me, this is the kind of tutorial that I would want to watch, where the person actually fights it and kills it and explains as they go, versus just seeing clips of each attack and being told, he tips his head to the left and then this happens. Because it's like, on in one of them, you're kind of seeing the muscle memory at work, and in the other one, you're just reading textbook, right? And I'm a hands-on kind of person, so for me, this is better and easier to make. Um, but yeah, it... it the best advice I can give you is hit a couple times, dodge, hit a couple times, dodge, hit a couple times, dodge, and just get those iframes down. Because if you don't get those iframes down in Koshai, you're done. End of story. Fight lost. Um, I guess I'll show the armor and stuff real quick. I've never done this in a tutorial before, but um, I'll just do it because why not, I guess. Uh, so yeah, here's the sword. They all have the same effects, which is garbage, but... And there's the uh, hammer, and the chain blades, and the axe. I actually like the axe. And the pike. I really like the pike. Which might be the only one worth uh, making, so. Uh, and then the armor. Antlers. Weird fish scale thing. Cool gloves, and decent-ish pants. So, yep. Yeah, um... Peace out.